Hello, this is Nerdy Low Cosplay, and I am going to give you a quick tutorial on how to easily add lightsabers with the free software called GIMP. I'll put a link to the description below. So, to get this effect, the first thing you will need to do is open up your image. It's always a good idea to have um, like the blades in here as a background. It makes it way easier to do the edits. Okay, so this is the next one I have to do. I'm going to rotate it, keep the color, don't know what that means, but not super matter. Okay, the first thing I need to go do is go down to this button and create a new layer. Um, the only important thing about this is what color you fill it with. Um, you want to fill it with black. For me, that's my background color, but it could also be a foreground color or something else, but we're going to choose background, so it's black. Okay, um, next thing we need to do is we're going to draw out the shape of the lightsabers. You want to click this little eye here, but make sure you stay in this layer. I'm going to zoom in, too much zoom, and go to my first saber. So notice again, I'm clicked into the black layer, but the black layer is invisible. I'm going to click my select tool up here. And I'm just going to go in and select the blade. It doesn't have to be like super exact and perfect because you're going to end up blurring it later. Okay, that's blade number one done. I'm going to make my black layer visible by clicking that eye. Go to the paint can and then dye it white. Okay. Then I'm going to go to select, none, make my black layer invisible again, and I'm going to do the other blade. Since my body is in the middle of the blade, you can't, you can't do this in one go. You have to do one, two, three blades for each of the different pieces. So I'm going to do the same thing two more times. I'm going to select this guy. Make the layer visible, paint it white, select none, and select this one. Make the layer visible, paint white, select none. So these are all my little lightsaber pieces. I'm going to go ahead and duplicate that layer. I right click, duplicate layer. Okay. On that first layer, it doesn't actually matter which one. I'm going to go up here to filters, choose blur, and then Gaussian blur. I want to change this first part to be 50. I press return so that they both say 50 and press OK. It's not showing you what I did because the layers at the bottom, but this is what it does. Then to get it to the right color, I'm going to colorize by going colors, colorize, and then you can ch choose the color you want here. I have mine saved, so all my blades are the same color. Press OK. And then do the same thing to your other layer. For this guy, I want to do also filters. Blur, Gaussian Blur, but this time I want it only to be the number 15. That gives your blade a little bit more depth. Okay, and then again I'm going to colorize. Choose that same color. Okay. Now, to make sure you can see all the layers, you need to change your view to screen. So see up here how it says normal? I'm going to change that to screen. Then click this other one, change it to screen. And now you can see you have your blades. If you want your lightsabers to be a bit more um, bright, I guess, you can duplicate these layers. So if I said duplicate layer, do you see how it got like thicker? So that's a good way to, I guess, get more of a burst of color with your lightsabers. But I like how it is now. So I'm going to go ahead and export it to a PNG. 
this is my fourth one from this photo shoot so i'm just gonna call this ahsoka garage three no four and then it's gonna export it and that is all that is how you make your lightsabers <laughs>